Okay. Here is an episode of Isaac Upgrade's Cheap Things with Cheap Stuff. So this is the board that was on there. It's the uh, Make board. Um, I think this is the Hacka, H-I-C-K-K-A. It's a fully assembled Delta on eBay that I found. Super cheap, $300. Um, but I'm replacing it with um, MKS S-Mini board from MKS on AliExpress. Uh, they were all the way down to $16. So <clears throat> I just unplugged all the cords um, and now I'm plugging them all in on this board. They have the same connector style, so it makes it super easy. You just have to, you can't use the stock screen. You can use the stock power. It comes with this, you just can't use the switch anymore. And then the other thing, you just have to make sure when you plug in um, your full graphic screen instead of this little screen, so you have to switch the connectors in the background. Um, but yeah, that's, uh, I got everything set up and um, I'll post the config file and the firmware for the MKS and uh, yeah, I'll get this going. Okay, I got the board sitting in here. I had to plug the thermistor in the middle one. The power plugs in, USB plugs in, the board's kind of shifted. It'll look better once it's all in there. Um, neither fan is spinning. So I'll have to figure out where the fans go. Okay, so for the fans, there's a 12 volt here and a 12 volt there but you have to switch the black and red wires so i used a pin also this um and like you kind of push the push the fan wires in and then you push the tab down and you can pull the steel things out and you can switch them and then you can switch sides of what the black and red is on and then your fans will work Alright, so I got this back on. My first print. That was interesting. Ooh, the screen is live. Holy crap, that is quiet. Is it extruding? It's extruding backwards. Okay, never mind. But it might be. Doesn't look horrible. You can see where I changed it though from 35 to 70. You can see the X. It's making progress. Definitely printing fast. 